Hey guys, welcome to the New Pursuits Podcast, episode two. Two also happens to be a number of best friends I have in this VC. You guys can go fight over that. That's messed up, bro. All right, go on. <laughs> well, anyways, I'm Citrus, or Tyler. I'm Grim, a.k.a. Sean. I'm um, Breeze, a.k.a. Donovan. We're joined by our member Calvin, a.k.a. Sergeant Enable, the self proclaimed Rocket League pro. And... Hey guys, how's it going? All right, let's All get right. this. Let's get show I'm excited. Hey, so yeah. new member. Well, not new member. He's always kind of been here, but uh, he wasn't here for the first one because uh, I ended up being here. A little behind the scenes. Yeah, we, te- we recorded we te- it at like 3 a.m. So. <laughs> oh, I don't know what you're talking about. I mean, we yeah, teased him in the first, so you guys know of him, but now you're going to learn about him. Yeah. Yeah. You're going to regret that. I promise probably. You. Probably. So, yeah. Calvin's a uh, Rocky League addict. That is that true. Anybody that's out there, one v one me. I'm down. No, uh, diamond, <laughs> diamond, diamond's the cap. Diamond's the cap. I can't wait for you to, to see your, your butt get kicked. I want to be one of the grand champ. Why not? I can see no. you winning that. Yeah, good. See, maybe no. a two. Actually, maybe Whoa. a two v two. Maybe a two v two. Yeah. No. What, what about that one guy that does freaking freestyles, bro? What he he's he's gonna sauce you up. Left him here. He's a supersonic legend. Oh no, <laughs> no. Okay. Well, anyways, uh, so, let's get into the juicy bits. How? Uh, let's go. Let's go down the line and, and talk about how we all met, Calvin. Uh, you want to okay. start since you were the first? Dude, I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. I don't remember. It was. I, oh my god. I think it, it was, I think it was okay. fourth grade. Yeah, I was fourth. You were fourth grade. Or I was fourth. Grade? I was fourth. I think. And then yeah, I was third. And then we met in Cub Scouts. Yeah. When we were very young. So, so we did Cub Scouts. Calvin was a little baby. He quit, and I went on to Boy Scouts, and then okay. <laughs> hey, I would just say, um, so yeah, we we met in fourth grade. Did did Cub Scouts together? Um, well, we'll tell a story about that later. Uh, some very bad things happened on that first camping oh, trip we no. did. Hole in the wall. Yeah, hole in the wall. What? <laughs> uh... <laughs> okay. So what? My next. And then yeah, yeah, yeah. and then. I met you, Donovan, in you met fifth, fifth grade, grade. in uh, that yeah. classroom, and I don't, I don't remember our first interaction, but I just remember like seeing you, and I was like, "This kid's got to be cool." Yeah, I, I was the no, new, I, I was the new student. Yeah, and I was like, Dude. "This," because I always remember being little and seeing like new kids, and they always like would make friends, and I always wanted to have yeah. like a new kid as my friend, so I was like, "This is the one." No, okay. Well, let me let me talk about what happened on my side. All right. Oh so no. So I remember um, Alvin. So I don't know if we're gonna have Alvin on here, but we'll probably bring him up or because he's he's a really uh, important factor in a lot of our stories. Yeah. So Alvin was like, he like he was in middle school. He's like, all right, you need to get this other teacher. All right, she's amazing, bro. Um, I forgot her name, Calvin. It's the one across to our right. Miss, it's Mrs. The, Anderson. It's a, no, the super short one, bro. The blonde Mrs. one. Mrs. Oh, uh, Mrs. Shank. Is this, yeah, we're talking, it's okay. No, we're talking middle school, the, right? Middle school. No, yeah. there no, was no, a, no, this is elementary. Elementary, elementary. It was, okay, El, dude, Miss Anderson was a total asshole. I'm just... Not to you. I, that, I dude. Not to well, me. Yeah, 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 she was. But, <laughs> not to me. Yeah, you done, yeah. Not to you. So, listen, all right? I remember uh, I was like, like, I came in the second day of school or something. All right, so I wasn't there the first day, which happens all the time. I don't know why I'm always a new student at schools for some reason, but uh, I went, and they just shoved me in her class, and she's like, "Um, there, I have thirty six students in here. You're not supposed to be in here." And I remember, I didn't even know what we were supposed to be doing. I couldn't read. So like, take out your book, and I had a panic attack. I was like, "Oh freak! I can't read! I can't read!" And then they're like, "All right, Miss Anderson." They just took me to her class, and then I just vibed in there, and then. I saw this Calvin guy. I was like, yo, this guy's pretty cool. You're like, yeah, we should play some games, bro. You I forgot like, okay. how to read? Dude, I'm I'm bad at reading. No, I was just bad at reading. Like, I didn't forget how to read. Was it like public this is, speaking? This is, this is, this... No, no, no. It was just read yourself. <laughs> I was just really bad at reading. <laughs> okay. I didn't know. What... I, don't, I don't know. I feel hey, like it's, it's... you always what? have like what? an internal what? monologue, don't you? Like does everyone, I, everyone has that internal monologue, don't they? Uh, apparently, some yeah, people no, don't, but I got, I got some it. Some people don't. What to like, read? Think when the images no, or some shit. Yeah, yeah, like internal monologue. So, so people think, and they like they have this inner voice that speaks to them, or like people see yeah. pictures and stuff when they think, like, oh, they think of a cup, they think of a picture of a cup, rather than like saying the word cup in their head. 
I, I say words. Yeah. I, I have an yeah. inner monologue, but I, I don't I don't I think it'd be weird to like not have that voice. Well, I have that voice. I, I was just saying I just couldn't read. <laughs> just that <laughs> but uh, yeah, Don, we used to we always used to play kickball. Remember that? At lunch? Yeah, and I, I was, was always uh, the worst. I was always the worst. I I <laughs> never knew how to kick, and I would kick, <laughs> and I would always perfectly have it go up and behind me. Like I would kick like freaking C's, the whole letter C yeah, around me. I remember that. Remember that, that one guard that sent, like the ball to space? Do you remember that? You remember that Wait, one what? guard who kicked? Do you not remember that? No, we that was a kid. That was a oh, kid. I thought it was a guard. I could have sworn one of the guards played with us. Dude, elementary dodgeball um, was horrifying. Yeah, I remember. I remember. You. I remember. I oh, I completely remember. Like crystal clear image of me just nailing this kid in the face, and they were the big <laughs> dodgeballs too, like the Dude, ones that yeah, made yeah, the boing sound. That. And I remember I had detention for three days. I was so sad. Well, back when we used to play dodgeball in <laughs> elementary, they didn't give us these like little foam piddly ones. They gave us in, in yeah. elementary. They gave us the handballs. They gave us handballs, which yeah, are meant for like things. fucking soccer. No, those were like meant for like, hey, when we were in elementary school, those were meant for the big kids. And then when we <laughs> became the big kids, we got like the little ones. Kids were I'm getting telling. knocked out. We were we didn't even play on the <laughs> gym or anything. We would play on the hard pavement outside. Yeah, I remember yeah. that. I remember that. Calvin, you're yeah, cutting out. But um, um, Sean needs to explain how he met you. So I met Calvin like, <clears throat> was it sophomore year? Yeah, it was it was in it was in Armstrong's class that you guys talked about. Oh yeah, we all met him basically. We all met. Well, I knew I also knew of uh, Sean, but um, parents. no, yeah. I just knew I just knew of you like really? because yeah, I've seen I've seen, Diamond showed me like videos and you would be in it. And I'd be like that oh. Sean kid seems funny. <laughs> Wait, so we yeah. all met Sean in Armstrong's. Mm-hmm. I had PE yeah. with. So that's how I met okay, him. Okay, okay. Because yeah. in my head, back when I'm strong, I was like, who is well, this kid? Like, I feel like Calvin and, and uh, Donovan knew him. I was like, who is this kid? Just another one of well, Calvin would... and Donovan's friends. But then but then, event, I'm coming to learn now, after I've graduated, that 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 nobody knew where this guy came from. No, no, no. We basically connect. Like, we knew of him. Like, I saw him around. I was like acquaintances. But I think we like connected and like became friend friends during that year. Yeah, I'm strong, yeah. Shout out to Armstrong, two podcasts in a row. Yeah, because I only came here uh, to, to to this town like sixth grade, and it, I had my own like circle of friends, and then I met you yeah. guys. I was, was just here. watching was the last episode. Watching the last episode, I was thinking of all the things I did in Armstrong's class that you guys didn't oh, talk well. about. Oh, well, we were waiting for it already. <laughs> we were waiting for it. Uh, your your expansion you wanna, pack. You're the DLC. You want to get there? Right, you want to talk about that right now? Hold on. We, we, we got we got another topic. We got another topic. We we got to talk about your, your right. dreams, Calvin. Yeah, we what, didn't talk. What do you what do you, oh, yeah, what, where, what do you do? see yourself in life? Yeah. What do you what do you uh, see yourself in? And if you become like a hardcore like, you're already a member, but if you become like a hardcore like, be here every video. What do you expect out of this channel too? Right, one All right, well, to cool. start, yeah, to start off, um, in like five years, that's a good range. Um, I do expect myself to see you still hanging out with you guys. You know, being friends but you know just in the adult stage of life um you know possibly living together hint hint foreshadowing no 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 uh, cut that out <laughs> <laughs> got it see obviously um i do want to become like a pro rocket league player for esports that See, would be lovely like, like I, I would i would love that it's got an addiction um, yeah, I, I do i really do but that would be that would be something i see um if and not, what team you get signed to again? I want G two, G two. All right, G two. If you're watching, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, job wise, if it's not that, probably something with uh, engineering or welding, similar to I think what Sean said last episode. Yeah. But somewhere around there, I would love to do that. Probably aerospace engineering, most yeah, likely. Okay. That's pretty cool. You can get us on some ships. For the, for the channel, I would I would honestly love to see us go and be like big, be like one of the big podcasts out there, you know, like top five or whatever. I'd love uh, to see that. Honestly, it'd, be, I, it'd be amazing. Yeah, if, and I I do I would love to be a member almost every episode. Because um, yeah. I feel like this four right here, this four is like we got the stories to everything. Because yeah, I had like Sean has stories from like 
what back to before you came to Roseman High. Um, I have stories of like other like the other groups like David's groups that I don't know if I. <laughs> I got stories but, um, of of like ten freaking other groups. Yeah, so I think I think like this four is really good, and then Diamond's yeah. mixed in it always. He's always mixed in everything. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> dude, I, I I still don't know how David's my friend. Like, yeah, that was funny. We were talking they, about that. You know how the powder <laughs> puff girls were made, and how how that homie spilled Chemical X. Yeah, yeah, Donovan's Chemical X. <laughs> and chemical X. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and everything yeah, nice. I would, honestly, I would honestly love to see this channel be, be trending. I think it'd be amazing. Yeah, yeah. Well, we plan on doing more than just podcasts, and that, uh, that's my most exactly. Exciting. And I would want to help out in any way. I don't little... want to just be like, I don't want to just be sitting here on the side and be yeah, like, we you know, we have an idea, but I... we don't want to say and set in stone just uh, yet. Yeah, just we get yeah. But, but, but we, I want, I want to something... genuinely help. Yeah, I want to well, put in the work and the commitment and the ethic. Well, we want you. I do it. I don't. I don't do anything. You're welcome, and and we want here. Um, we like like Donovan said, we don't we don't want to give too much away and not guarantee anything either. But we got a little something in the works other than just a podcast, possibly. Don't 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 <laughs> hold me to anything, but I think it'll be pretty funny. Yep. All right. Um, you bet. Is that all the questions? I can't remember. I think it is. Yeah, I think so. All right. So mm-hmm. what, what are we starting off on? You want to well, talk about the stuff already, you missed out on Armstrong's? We, well, we already introduced Hole in the Wall, too, though. So yeah, I'm talking about that. I want to talk about that. <laughs> okay. So, so it was a gone. traumatic experience. <laughs> so our first camping experience for me and Tyler, we hit the Hole in the Wall. I don't even remember where it is. It's just on the boondocks of the desert. It's Cub Scouts. And it's named, Ho- it's just, it's just named Hole in the Wall because there's, like, this rock with just, like, a like a hole in, like, the rock wall. And that's in why the it's Hole in the Wall. I thought it's- that was Dude, I, I remember, thought it was so stupid. I remember passing signs that were like, go back, no gas stations in, within 100 miles. <laughs> like, signs that we pass, and oh God, it was just in the, the middle dunes. of nowhere. I'm going to kill you. But before we even get to get there, let's talk about what happened in the car on the way there. Oh, okay. Oh. Well, yeah, let's talk about what oh. happened on the car on the way there. So, so when we you burnt were, your finger? <laughs> we were dumb little 12, 13 year olds. I don't remember exactly how old you were, how old I was. I was in fifth grade, so I was 12. Calvin, you must have been 11. Yeah, I don't um, remember. I, I, I was like 12 in fifth again. grade. If you're, if you're younger than me, that makes sense. Um, okay, then, yeah. So uh, um, we had planned this thing. It was the last like initiation to go into Boy Scouts, was doing this Cub Scout meeting with Boy Scouts. And we, we got in the car in our, in our local hometown. My, my, my father had to run in to grab some, like, ice for the ice chest or whatever we were bringing. And me being a dummy little 12-year-old, <laughs> <laughs> charged up the cigarette lighter, pulled it out, and stuck my finger onto it, burnt the crap out of my finger, got a huge-ass blister right before we went just, camping. That was it. Was, it was the funniest because I was, like, looking at the window, and I hear him scream. <laughs> and I'm like, what happened? And he's like, I just burnt my finger. And I, I just started laughing because of how it, I was like, why would you ever? It literally says, I'm pretty sure it said on the thing, caution hot. And you were like, oh. I, I'm going to go back to, I'm going to go to Donovan's defense. I forgot how to read. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, different. I had a book. You just didn't read it. You, you just said, you're like, what do you mean? You were, you were in fifth grade too, whatever. You can't talk. Yeah. <laughs> Um, no wait, hold on. You said your dad was with you when you guys went there, or yeah, was so, on the yeah, way there? So my dad took us there. We it was like yeah, five or six cars. Chaperones. Yeah, it was like five or six cars. My father used was one of the chaperones, and he he took us there. And before we got even on the road, he was in the store buying ice. I think for the ice chest. I, I can't. I think he was buying ice, and I just stuck my finger onto it. Had a blister the entire way there. But then I got there, and I, I either I completely forgot about it, or I completely healed, and I didn't feel anything. Um, oh, we so lost anyways, Billy. we get there, did we, did we get there midday, evening, or night? I can't remember if we were setting night. up our tent in I the middle of the night. specifically remember because of how was traumatic it? it was. It was, was it, wait, time. was it the first night it or the second like, night? I thought it was the second night no, that we No, had. it was both. It was both. <laughs> okay. Because it was at like 10 p.m. when oh, we arrived. Yeah. We had to it set up our tent than... behind another tent because, okay, I got it, I got it. <laughs> um... 
so so we finally get there after like a three hour drive or something. I don't know. I was twelve. It was, felt like fourteen hours. Um, we set up our tents, and then before we can even set up our tents, the the wind is is pushing at a good eighty miles an hour in the middle of the desert with absolutely nothing around in like fifty miles. So, of course, we we struggled for about an hour putting up our tent in the pitch black. And well, go ahead, Calvin. Tell me what happened when we got in the tent. So we get situated in the tent, right? We're laying down in our sleeping bags. And then it just, the the wind just hit like a bullet train. <laughs> like the tent would get down, like the top of the tent was on our face. Yeah. And it was so windy. We all thought we were going to like probably suffocate and die. And this was a And I specifically, tent. I specifically remember Traden's tent being blown off. Like remember it blew off? Yeah, they woke up I, at I about 3 a.m. And they were just standing outside because they were like, yeah, our tent broke. So they just crawled into a bag. <laughs> With no stakes and anything holding it up, they just crawled into another bag, into their sleeping bags, and just fell asleep for the rest of the night. Yeah, and then that was the next night the same thing happened. And, no, it was, it was we're, horrifying. We're, we're for a bunch of little 12-year-olds being placed in the wilderness all alone, I mean, we weren't all alone. They, But the adults were a good they were 500... Like a mile away. Yeah, they were like a good 500 <sighs> yards away. Like a good football... Like two football fields away from us. Um camping in a different location my dad's tent completely snapped in half he had to sleep in the car uh but we, we toughed that. it out and then we went hiking the next day and uh got our yeah like, and i hated that I, I don't know if i ever told you this yes but we went up to these sand dunes right oh and no, no, no i'm talking about the there. hole in the wall actually like going to see oh. the hole in the wall that no, was that actually was fun. after the sand dunes that was, was after the sand dunes. Okay. yeah here comes because we came back and then it was the next day here and comes part that, three of trauma, all right? So part one was burning yeah. myself. Part two was sleeping in a coffin. <laughs> <laughs> and, and here's part three. And so it was awful. I still want to kill you for what you did. <laughs> so Listen, we're like... A boy's we got to the, the, survive. We were like three-fourths away, right? And I had water. I was going to get my water. I was like, oh, I'm thirsty. I like tripped. A, I tripped and I life. fell and my entire canteen emptied. <laughs> I was, was water oh, oh, and we God. still had the hike okay, back. Well, we need context clues, all right? So, <laughs> so we we pull up like we drive an hour away from camp. We pull up to these these sand dunes out in California, and the the hike to the top of like the sand dunes at the beginning was like four miles up, nothing but just hard sand in the in the middle of the summer in blazing heat. So one, we, we ran, I ran out of water very quickly. I got to the top and was out of water and I had to hike like either two miles back or four miles back. I can't remember if it was eight miles in total or four miles in total and two miles up and two miles back. It doesn't matter. Anyways, I ran out of water right when I got to the top. As Calvin just described, he, he really fucked it Dude, I <laughs> on the way up. Like, I just remember I wanted to cry. I just wanted to lay there and cry and let you guys come back, go up and come back. Yeah. So, yeah, but then we get to the top, and I, I not really thirsty because I kind of forgot about it because we were having fun, right? And then we had the thing where everyone was, like, sliding down the sand dunes or running down it, and you'd hear, like, the cave noises under it. That was pretty cool. That you remember that? Actually, that was horrifying. It yeah, was no, cool. it was scary because I thought Cause it was going to collapse. It was just sand, and we could get, like, on the middle of the slope, if you stopped, you could, one, feel the vibrations of, like, the cave beneath us collapsing, and two, all the sand shifting, and three... The, the noise of like the the rumbling of all like the stuff it sounded moving. like like a like a ghost ship like if it was like just sitting in the like that's kind of what I described it as because it made like that humming sound type thing yeah so then this is the part where I want to kill Tyler <laughs> he's got no water I got no water we get back to the car there's a thing of sprite I'm like all right Tyler we'll half it he downs the entire thing <laughs> <laughs> I, I I remember like looking in my like looking away, getting in my pocket, getting something, and I, I look back and I see him chugging it, and I just see the last drop go down his throat, and I was like, "You're kidding me." Hold on, context clues. <laughs> no, there is no context for what happened. Context It was my dad's sprite that he had bought for himself that I just booked. So you dropped from him. <laughs> And you scoot over Calvin. That's yes, Calvin. that's exactly yeah. what happened. Anyways, Calvin had a very thirsty hour-long drive back to camp. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyways, uh, the whole experience was... It, it was, was fun. It I'm was gonna, fun. I it was fun. After all these years, it was a good experience. Yeah, Terrifying in really the moment. Yeah. Um, 
but after all these years, I think it was a good experience. All right, let's let's yeah, go man, on to fun. to something that Time we can all talk about. What happened? In why, don't I, why don't I just tell? Yeah, why don't, I was just about to say, why don't I tell the audience what I've done in Armstrong? <laughs> These thousands of countless uh, minutes. Okay. without incriminating you yourself. Sport? Wait, what? I said without incriminating so yourself. Oh yeah. Well, uh, it's kind of hard. It's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. I'm not going to incriminate myself. I you didn't do did anything wrong. You did smart fake coke. Stop! No. <laughs> That's not what happened. <laughs> No, you attempted no, to I, I speci- no, I specifically remember we found it. Uh, we got an Altoid from somebody, and I, I just, I, you know, yeah. I crushed it up. But I was not gonna snort it. That was not the point of this context. We were trying to get Armstrong to like look at a sus. So I had our backpacks propped up. I had yeah, aviator shades. I had my my ID card, um, and then I, I rolled up like a a receipt, and then I had it all there, and I had some money on the table. And I just had it open. And when Armstrong walked by, I grabbed all the backpacks and I threw it on top of the stuff and threw the backpacks off the table. And I mean, what did Armstrong say? He was like, what, what was under there? Right? He, he was like, what no, you guys no, doing? Yeah, he was like, he's like, what's popping, guys? We're like, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> that, 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 that. No, that also it, did it, mine. I had a whole box of them. Yeah, no, that, it was. That was Catherine's. Oh, was it yours? It no, been, I it remember been having been. a lot of Altoids. Software. Yeah, no, it was. It was I'm, I'm pretty sure it was Sean's. And then there was the time where I took Tyler's phone and I threw it, and it almost hit the like the, the <laughs> ceiling and went inside the ceiling. And I remember Armstrong <laughs> turning around right as the phone <laughs> fell, and I was and he didn't see it. But I remember we just started laughing, and he told us to stop laughing because he was sleeping. We weren't listening. We can, we can also, it was, I don't think you were there, Sean, but it was me, Calvin, and, and Donovan making, like, weird noises to make music, and Armstrong eventually, after, like, 30 minutes of us just making random childish noises <laughs> in, in high school, it was just like, okay, come on, guys, you gotta stop. Oh, yeah, no, we were, so, we started, <laughs> we started making, like, really bad parodies of, um, like, songs, like, we started off, like, Mario. Yeah. We just started like, going off the other song, like the Tetris. Like it was just like like he was like teaching. We're like, do, 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 do. And, like and then and then and then we'd switch and be like, do, 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 do. and then we were just like in freaking in sync. And he was like, what What are you guys doing? You guys need to stop. And then there was a time where me and Donovan slap boxed in the middle of the class. <laughs> yeah, no, he turned he around up. and yeah, look, <laughs> he was teaching like I. He's he's always perfectly like out of out of place but that time he was like what are y'all doing because all you just yeah all just, he's like slamming <laughs> he's like he just like snaps his neck yeah he's like, so and then i believe the next year when we had him for a computer not just a media, oh but my a gosh we went to the the lab cl- like the lab classroom no sean you weren't here for this, this. When, i don't this know if he's going to well, I don't know if we told you this, but I, I took a screwdriver, screwdriver and I stabbed it in the yeah. wall. Yeah. No, 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 no. We lost no. the keys. No, we had a, remember we had to get the camera and then we were locked outside the door and it was super cold. You remember that, Calvin? And you had your crutches and you couldn't do anything? I hated that. Oh, I should probably tell them why I had crutches. <laughs> I don't want to yeah. tell them why I had crutches. Go ahead, Calvin. <laughs> I could tell them why you had crutches. <laughs> so, in well, doesn't talk much. Maybe he explains in, it. Yeah. Sean, talk about our welding. <coughs> okay, first, I want to say I'm sick. That's why I'm coughing all the time. But anyways, so we are doing a project for welding. And I was like, okay, Calvin, your job, go outside, cut us this metal. He's like, okay, I can do that. I'm like, okay, thank you. He goes outside, and he cuts the metal, right? That's what you think happens. But <laughs> <laughs> apparently, like a giant beam, really not safe. It's like by the saws, and it just like fell off the table and absolutely demolished his toe. Like yeah. His so toe. what happened was, I was uh, the it was like a seventy five pound piece of construction yeah. metal, like industrial metal, and it was it was like, I think it was like six feet, twelve maybe. It was a really long piece. So I was like, okay, I gotta move this off, which is not hard. So I pick it up. I move. I start moving it. The other end of the bar catches something, rips it out of my hand, and it falls on my big right toe. And I remember mm. thinking, I was like, "Man, that hurt!" And I didn't realize anything yet. So I cut the metal, and then I feel a tingling in my toe. I'm like, "That can't be right." I come back. I throw the metal on the table, and then I sit down on the, my stool, 
and I take off my shoe and my sock, my entire toenail's gone. Um, luckily though, my toe like wasn't severed. It's I didn't horrible. break the bone. Yeah, so it was just a toenail. And I, I remember Mr. Riley. He was like, "Uh, hey man, am I gonna have to do any papers?" I was like, "Oh yeah, thanks, 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 Mr. <laughs> Riley. I'll never, I'll never forgive you for that." Um, so was he saying, yeah, like, then, "Yeah, that ain't going back." No, he said it was gonna take a, a twelve to eighteen months. And still, it's, it's going it's, back. It's, <laughs> yeah, it's like it's not even twelve months yet, and it's completely back now. But it, it's it just hurts if I stub it. Like if I stub, oh, I want to cry. <laughs> but um, yes, yeah, so and then I had crutches, and I was in we were in Armstrong's, and we were locked out, and it was like negative thirty two degrees. <laughs> it was that cold. Probably, doesn't it's probably, exist. It's fresh. <laughs> it was it's very like cold. 60. Oh yeah, sixty or fifty. But we live in California, where yeah, you know it's very, dry very and cold. cold. Yeah. It's either dry and cold or freaking dry and gosh, dang, blazing hot. I just I remember my my foot getting um frostbite because I didn't have a shoe on it. It was just wrapped, and I was like, oh, "Please yeah. let's say it." I said, "Did I not bang on the door with my crutch?" I could have swore I did. Dude, I don't know how we. I just know we had to put the key in and we slammed into the door like freaking FBI agent and got in somehow. No, because he handed us <laughs> he handed us a set of like oh, hundred yeah. keys. Oh, and he, my he's like God. this one. And we gave <laughs> the Calvin the keys, which was mistake number one, because he immediately no, forgot. Which I key found it in like the was. fourth try. No no no. no I, not he, the fourth try. Yeah, yes, that no. we would have never been in that situation if you just held on to <laughs> if you held on to the key he specifically gave us to put in the door. Well I was a, a cripple, so you know yeah, that, and then and then we tried every single one we're like they all they work. And the Kevin's like, hold on. And he tried this one that we tried like fourth and it worked. And we're like, well, why was that so hard? Yeah, we busted the door down. We were in there for like a good 15 minutes searching for something. I don't think we found anything, did we? No. Nah, I don't think we, we did. Didn't, we didn't find anything. He's like, look for a box. And then we came back and he's it was like, a oh, free it's period. probably in the other room. It was it was just a free period. That's what it was, says. We went in that room, we messed around, I threw yeah, some markers around. Because we always did our work, right? We always did our work in that class. Yeah, yeah. at home. <laughs> dude, I dude, and that, that class was my free period. It was my, oh, shoot, I did do the calculus homework. And I did it all that class. Uh-huh. It was awful. Um, <laughs> the last, like... And then there, oh, wait, Tyler. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, hold on. Remember, Tyler, <laughs> we took a, a flash card and I shoved it in the computer disk drive. You remember that, Tyler? <laughs> <laughs> not my computer or your computer? It was your it computer, was... Donovan. <laughs> <laughs> you wonder why so your it... disk drive never worked. Because he no. put it in there, and it just complete The whole thing started spinning. It was like... And I was like, oh oh So I went in your computer when you weren't there, disconnected the disk drive so absolutely nothing would work, and then put it all back together. I was like, I didn't touch nothing. Yeah, that, I, I bet you that flashcard's still in there. Yeah. I never I took it out. <laughs> Let me... We need to give context to the computer. So this class, all right, this was this our computer class. Sean unfortunately wasn't able to make it. I think you needed your first period for something, right, Sean? Yeah, I just I didn't have space in my schedule to. Yeah. Do that. So this was our network. Well, I was a network plus Tyler and Calvor and A plus certification, which is just like IT type beat, all right. And we had like a bunch of computers, right? They they were not that good, but um, yeah, just some pre uh knowledge Perfect. yeah but i remember like i said i didn't really do much of the working class at the time and i remember there was one week it, i was just so stressed because of calculus and i remember he was like it's grade time and i was like oh shoot <laughs> and i remember i saw my grade go from a perfect hundred and he went down i went like b c d f i had like a i had like a 59 percent in that class it was like the lowest grade i've ever had for a because while he, okay so, so bad. Since he would give out like, what, ten assignments every two weeks or something, something like close to yeah, that, it ten was, to fifteen. It was, he would assign like a chapter. Yeah, he'd assign like a chapter chapter, whole chapter, and it was weeks. anywhere from like ten to fifteen assignments for like a week. No, the biggest one was like thirteen. Remember, we did it at my house. No, he was freaking some, cracked. Yeah, I know, yeah, I know yeah. we did it. At my, I, I know we did it at your house. I just know the last day before um s- winter break. Yeah, I think it was the last day before winter break. I had about 30 assignments I had not done <laughs> because he, he says it's grading time, which means he puts it in the grade book, but then he doesn't really care if you just do them any other time after that. So I would just not do any work and then just have one whole weekend where I just want to kill myself. 
Um, yeah. It was like it was like probably seventeen hours. So seventeen, like it was like probably like sixteen, seventeen hours just straight of like just like work for that class. Yeah, I remember doing that over the uh, the, the quarantine when we weren't at school for a long time, and I had to grind out all of them. Yeah, the last week of my but, senior year. Oh my god, <laughs> I had like yeah. fifty assignments then, I had not done all I had quarantine to do a final as well. Yeah, oh, I had, we had no we for the final Calvin. He didn't give us one. No, he didn't. No, he didn't. He was I just like finish one. chapter fourteen, which was like the review of the entire course, and then that was it. No, the yeah. reason I did is because he gave me the network plus certification test. Yeah, for like test out. Well, that's what so I wanted. I, like, I like... wanted to get my A plus certification, but um, he didn't give it to us. You probably had a talk, so you probably didn't check your emails. But um, no, okay. The reason why he like, it sounds like uh, his class was like, bu- like baloney, right? I mean, it was fine, but the only reason it was baloney is because he wasn't even supposed to be teaching that class until that year because the teacher we brought up last year, one that like you know said say a and dipped, right? This is actually before he dipped. They kind of screwed him over. They're like, you're only teaching math, and he's like, are you kidding me? And then Armstrong, which also has like a similar uh. Like certification and stuff was like, yeah, he was able to uh, teach it. So they're like, all right, you're a computer man now because you already teach digital media. And they gave us absolutely nothing. No labs to do any work in anything. They barely, like when we first got through the first two weeks of that class was us running around the school looking for computers and keyboards and stuff and assembling it all in the classroom. Yeah, we basically built that classroom. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. So it was kind of rough. They kind of didn't give him any, like, stuff. He didn't even know how to do it. He was just, like, the whole first week he was testing stuff because, you know, it was just our school. I don't know why they were, like, yo, we were in broke mode. And they started just killing off teachers. They killed they off firing all the money on, like, the football or some shit. Yeah. And yeah, now, now look what that got him. They, we don't have football this year. <laughs> Wait, there was, some, there was something I wanted to talk to you, Sean. Yeah. I remember you guys mentioning last episode about six period substitutes. Oh yeah. Uh, remember the substitute. Everything. Remember the substitute that was in Mrs. Uh, our English our English class sophomore year. Remember that guy who like went her desk and ate her candy or food. The yeah. guy that's like all philosophical. <laughs> yeah. Do you remember like one of the last days? He he was just oh he was making me so mad, and he came up to me, and he was like remember. I'm not your enemy. And I was like, oh, yeah. What? I remember and he just walked that. away. And I was like, what? No. I was like, <laughs> that same stuff. He's probably trying pressed... not to get on your kill list. <laughs> no, PE, he literally pressed me. Like, he actually, like, wanted a fight. Like, not even capping. Because you know why? It was really hot inside. And so I was just opening the door to the gym to let the air go in. Because, you know, it was really windy that day. And I was like, it's really fucking hot. We're playing basketball. Let me just chill out. And he, like, walks over across the gym to harass me and like three other people just trying to cool down and he like gets in my face i'm like bro you're a grown-ass man talking to a freshman like what are you doing sounds awful i don't wait which guy no no it was it was it was this he would uh, always wear this like tan like uh button-up shirt oh my god i know um he were oh my god. yes he was, bald. he was bald yes yeah he's bald oh my god dude that man was wild his name his name we called him Mr. Steve. It was Mr. Steve. I remember. Yeah. yeah. I remember that. Yeah, because I, I, I had. You guys remember had... Mr. Dorito? <laughs> Dorito? <laughs> no, what? Like, no, dude. What are you you definitely <laughs> burnt on drugs that day. No, it's not. It's not <laughs> his were, actual name. You were looking at your Dorito <laughs> bag and I was like, "This is my new teacher." Yeah, you you hold over his head, mm, Dorito man. <laughs> well, I guess it's not the turn group. Never mind. No, we call but him I, remember, I remember I had really a class. Cool. He was subbing for one of my um, math classes early on. And him and this other student just started talking about alcohol. Like the entire class period. They're like, oh yeah, like we like I have you ever had tried tried this and like mix this with stuff? And then I think at the end it resolved in the, the guy being like, Hey, you want to go for a drink sometime? Uh was, was, like, was hey. it a mosh? Was it a mosh? <laughs> no, it was Dwayne. Oh, oh no. <laughs> It was Dwayne and that guy, and I was like, okay. Uh, I just sat there. Yeah, um, no, that guy, though. Go ahead. You, you, if you want to change, you can go on. Well, I was going to bring up Calvin's screwdriver. All right, bring it. What about it? Oh, you want to explain what you did <laughs> with your self-incrimination. screwdriver? Self-incrimination. I don't know the reasoning why, or 
I don't remember whole, why like, either. Reasoning. I think someone I just bet remember you to picking do it. it up. I just picked. I remember picking. It. Was it? Was it? Was it Owen? Was he the idiot that told dared me to do it? Pretty sure he was. Can't remember. No. Yeah, or your brother. Owen. Yeah, screw that kid. Episode um, you already called it Owen again. No, yeah, episode <laughs> one we called that Owen. Screw Owen. But yeah, I know. He made us lose. He made us lose. I love you, Owen. I lost my no, scholarship. They just grabbed it, and I just I was like, "What if this can go through the wall?" And I remember I'm trying to look away, and so I he was not in the room. Stabbed into the wall. He was not in the room. That's all I know. I think oh, we went in there randomly. Yeah. No, 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 no. The whole no, class no. was in there. The whole class was yeah, in the there. The whole class was in there. We were in the lab room that, that was not a lab room. It was a storage room yeah. of, like, the old math class before the teacher killed himself. Oh. Now, <laughs> that that left, all right? Left. <laughs> no, yeah, no. No, okay. It sound, I'm laughing because he, it didn't actually happen. I, I know this sounds bad. Like, it did happen, <laughs> but I swear to you, I don't know why he left. He just left. Yeah, that room was awful, all right? Because... He Armstrong wanted it to be like he had like great expectations for uh, that class, right? He's like, all right, we're like we're gonna build computers here, take apart stuff, do things. Yeah, that's time was dreaming. We went in there looking for crap, messing around, and like that room it was bad. He dedicated us to building a server so we can run games off of it for the class, like getting yeah, the server weird. that he bought to work, even though they yeah didn't educational ship Minecraft. The, yeah, they didn't ship. No, no, the whole he didn't buy it. He didn't buy it. No, they. School that was from though. the freaking military base. No, that was from the military base. They're like, y'all want this stuff? And then uh, oh, Mr. McComb last year, Mr. McComb like, got all the crap, and it was a bunch of like, servers and stuff. And McComb, if he was still there, he probably would have set it up and everything. He's like, I'm going to have y'all do this. But then, you know, they kind of, you know, you yoinked his position. I still, I yeah. want to, oh wait, no, I can't say this on the podcast. That, that's illegal. But those, <laughs> compu- those uh, computers and Mr. McComb, they were pretty, they were pretty nice. They were. They had like Are you gonna 16, steal it? 60s or yeah. 10, no? They 10, had ten eighties in it. Maybe yeah, probably. Because yeah, no, nice, Mr. E, they're they're probably still there. That's all I'm saying. They're still there. They're the right? one that Mr. E has in his room for catting and stuff. They oh, were he took them. Slow as shit. No, no, they're the exact same computers because Mr. Oh. E apparently built them all and then put them in that uh, class. Yo, if a couple go missing, don't blame me. <laughs> Dude, the school's gonna get wrong. They're, they're gonna trace back to this podcast and be like, "Dude, he definitely took them." Yeah, nah, the podcast look, look. goes like thirty minutes. In. If the school goes thirty minutes in, I, I salute them. Yeah, they're That's dedicated, bro. I know. Plus, I know Mr. Like Hansen a... would. Mr. Oh, Hansen would watch all of our episodes. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm I'm Armstrong would too. Man. Armstrong would be. I'm a... Armstrong would want to know definitely. what we're up to. Yeah, I, I all the cool teachers would. I want. I want to redirect uh, Mr. Hansen to this, but um, he's gonna be like. That's why there's a hole there. Yeah. <laughs> well, we'll wait till there's we're some, There was some funny. There was some funny stuff. I mean, we wait till we graduated. Yeah. Right. yeah. There was some funny stuff we did in Mr. Hansen's class too. Dude, I love like those reactions. Oh, yeah. Why don't we talk about the pencils we threw on the buses all the time? Oh yeah. yeah. Alvin is also a senior, by the way. Just. Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately. Oh, okay. So me and Calvin. Okay, I- I'll just go to a second. Me and Calvin. All right. So me and Calvin, uh, were pretty much like quote unquote best friends through like all the time we met each other. Like we were just immediately best friends. Every if they knew Calvin, they knew I was with them, right? Oh no! And yes, I'm getting up there. Right? <laughs> so it, 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 Calvin was a pretty much a very popular kid, all right? Because when people walk up to me, they're like, "Oh, you're Calvin's friend." I'm like, "Yeah." No, they said you're Calvin's friend, the one with the curly hair, right? And I'm like, "Yeah, I, I guess, I guess that's me." And um, so I remember in – so me and Calvin – well, actually, me, Calvin, Tyler, and a couple other people that may or may not come on the uh, podcast sooner or later all rode the same bus, all right? Because we live, like, around each other. Yeah, back yeah. in and, middle school. Yeah. And let's just say um, me and it's Calvin insane. were – we uh, for some reason, we we would always find pencils or we just have spare pencils. And uh, – no, you didn't I mean, have spares. That... You would use the only ones you had, and then you'd get to class and be like, I need a pencil. Yeah, or I would try to go search for it. Um, so basically, we, we were in that Call of Duty tomahawk type beat mode, and we would just we would lean back and just yeet and just throw it, and we'd just hear this like, ow, who's doing that or something? I, I, I don't know. I think it was the rush. We 
we didn't want to hurt anybody, but like we it was just so fun and like just seeing uh, either like people freak out and be like, "What the world was that?" It was just uh, very funny. But um, let's fast forward to eighth grade. So Tyler's not here because he he's obviously a grade above, right? So it's just me and Calvin. We're we're the kings of the uh, of, of middle school, right? Everyone knows uh, Calvin. Dude, I ponder what happened in that year because I know what happened in high school, but I only could imagine what what would have been down your 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 eighth grade year. There were there were so many good school. fights. I mean, not like good, oh, but yeah, like, they were funny, bro. They were so yeah. Funny. I remember that. But um, basically. Me and Calvin, so for some reason, our bus is always freaking late for some reason. Like, it's always our bus. It's, like, hecka late. And yeah. we were waiting for a long while. We're all, like, it's a really hot day. We're all scrunched together, about to get on the bus, right? And for some reason, everyone's all talking, whatever. Calvin sees a pike. He's like, what the? F-? He's like, yo, watch this. He throws it backwards, right? Just throws it backwards, doesn't think nothing of it. Little do we know, this, this guard, this pretty big guard, all right? Was talking to this little girl. She was like a sixth grader. Has glasses. Boom! Straight in the head, bro. Her glasses <laughs> fall down, hit the floor. He looks up and says, Who do that? <laughs> Everyone, silence, bro. Silence. All the people around Calvin were like his best friends, all right? Everyone but, knew that I did it, but nobody said anything. Yeah, yeah it was. Um, <laughs> remember, remember that? Remember Tyler DePain? Yeah, I was going to say Tyler. He turned DePain. around and looked at me. And he was like, dude, what are you doing? Like, he, he, <laughs> held, in, he held in his lap so hard. <laughs> wait, what are we, so, wait, I don't remember anything. Wait, what? No, you weren't there. This is eighth grade. Tyler DePayne. I said Tyler oh, DePayne. I thought you said Tyler. Tyler Do you remember no, the pen? Was, I was like, no. No. <laughs> no. no. It was, um, th- this kid lived, um, like, three houses next to me at that time. Yeah. Before yeah, he moved. Yeah, but basically, but, every. Everybody in this little circle all knew Calvin or didn't want to snitch, all right? And he's like, "We're no one's getting on this bus until someone tells me. <laughs> Homies, we, we, we're going to, like, prop up a chair and wait, bro. No one said crap. Then he's like, okay, y'all can go. And then Calvin was like, oh, man, bro, bro I did it. He's like, you don't have to take the blame. I know it's not you. Calvin's like, what? <laughs> and they didn't believe him. Even the guard didn't believe him. <laughs> Calvin tried to confess. was around his finger, bro. I tried to confess. And the guy was like, nah, man, I know it's not you. I was like, what? I was like, there's no way. And Calvin didn't even need to confess. We were already getting on the bus. And he, like, stopped before he got on. And he told him, he's like, yeah. nah, get on the I bus, tried, bro. I tried to repent, but apparently, I don't know. If that Wait. if that person that I hit ever watches this, I'm so sorry. Oh, my God. <laughs> was was uh, eighth grade when we had, um what's his name? We had uh, the what's that class we had? Yeah, remember- it was me and you in the wood. Do you guys remember Timmy though? No. PLTW. It was PLTW. What was it? Tommy? Oh no. It yes, it was Timmy. Tommy. And we jammed. No, no, no. This is a different person, Sean. Oh. But no, we we jammed Mrs. Cam's printer. Oh, okay, no. I jammed dude, her printer. Dude, not me. <laughs> Dude, okay, so we had this really big project. It, we had to get a bunch of wooden, like, sticks, right? And we had to build, like, the tallest it tower, like, right? Yeah. It was and pretty much like, beginning robotics, technically. It was because yeah, they had it's... the computer encoding stuff. And then, yeah. The, 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 yeah. Wait a second. It was all about using your story. mind and building stuff. Yeah. So, um, for some <laughs> reason, Calvin was like, watch this. And him and Tommy took a log. <laughs> Just threw it straight in, all right? I was like, uh, week later, uh, my printer's not working. What the? And I was like, uh, mm, I don't know what's going on here. I specifically remember looking inside, and I see the stick, like, <laughs> all cut up and stuck inside the, like, entrance sheet. <laughs> and I was like, oh, we screwed it. And I just realized everything I've ever done bad in school always starts with, watch this. <laughs> it always because, starts because I'm there, dude. You say watch this, and I see the fiery passion in your eyes that you're about to fuck something up and get away with it too. Yeah, ninety five percent of the stuff you do, you don't get away with. Like I remember in middle school, you that one teacher that was biased to you. You started just cursing and stuff, and just saying whatever you wanted. Someone just says like that the word dude crap, was my homie. Mr. Oh my god, we were in the class. No, no, yeah. After so after Mr. Stevenson passed away. Mr. Deal took over. And yeah, um, so I remember me and him, me and this dude, because I was, I also, um, my mom just passed away as well. So I was going through it and he would be there. Like, 
I don't know why, but I would like break down in that class and only that class, yeah, not every day. That. And but he would, he would like, he would like, like legitimately hug me and comfort me, and, and so we just became friends. And um, like a year later, I found out that he's friends with some of my family friends. So I thought that was pretty crazy. Anyways, one time in class, I was having a pretty good day, and I was sitting at a table with I think, uh, Aliana. Um, Andrew Briones and I think you mean who said Dora? Yeah. Oh no, no, no. Uh, and then um, that's another story for another day. <laughs> and then um, I don't remember who said next to me. Anyways, I would say like I would curse pretty often in that class, and Mister Deal would curse back with me. We'd make jokes. I remember I said a few like pretty bad words, and he laughed it off. As soon as Aliana said shit, he was like, "Go outside." He said they're outside, and I was like, but I, I just said so much bad things, and I never said it, but I was, that was like my mental process, and I just remember thinking, I was like, but why? I was like, why me? Why do I get away with these things? Because in sixth grade, Plot armor. we we put somebody in the, the porta potty and tipped it over. That was <laughs> you? <laughs> you guys, I don't that. remember that. That was you? That was you? I did not know you were part of that group. I was, and then the same kid, bro. The same kid. We pantsed him on the field the next day. But here's the oh, thing: yeah, everybody in that group, every everybody in that group got caught, but me. I was never questioned. Yeah, I was never sent up to the office or anything. Yeah, were you one that group of delinquents? Were you one that that participate in the pantsing or? I was like, I was like, all right, dude, we're gonna get this kid. And I remember because he was a huge part. He was like, he was my friend before he moved. And I was like, dude, run over there and do it. And I, I was such an antagonizer because I would come up oh, with these massive plans, are. watch them happen. Yeah, I would watch <laughs> them happen, and then I would leave the scene like I was never there. And they would like, I would, all right, all right, I'd be like, all right, meet me up here. And then I wouldn't show up there. They would, they, they would do the 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 crime and run you to that area. Them. Yes. <laughs> Yes. Well, no, you basically friend. hold him at gunpoint, blackmailed him, then freaking left the scene. I never, no, I never blackmailed nobody. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, I okay. don't blackmail people. That's 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 just just that's mail for me. You just mail them. <laughs> I'm starting you to see. Some, I'm starting this. to see some patterns from Calvin's past life to now. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I, in band class, Mr. Fandini was gonna kill me. I had the trumpet, and we had like this tube thing that were like, where if you'd build up spit and it'd make your trumpet play bad, you empty it. Yeah, I took it and oh. I flung it across the classroom, and it hit like five different people. And he saw, and he didn't say anything. He did not say anything. I don't know why. He just gave me a death look, and I just, I just, I just didn't show up to band class next day. I, I just, I, I just clashed that day. Oh my god! <laughs> I totally forgot. So, about yeah, that. any any colleges that um, want Calvin? Um, uh, he's no, a he's, a home <laughs> he's not a home record. He's not a home it's like he's a homeworker. He broke a house. <laughs> like I'm just please. saying, I'm probably like the reason why bad things happen in the group because I just I get this. I feed off. Oh, I feed off of energy. So oh, if I'm feeling what? good, I just I get hyper and I want to. I just want to have a good life. I want to have funny memories. Like now, hey, you know, like the hotel. I really oh, think that's, that's, what, I was about about that's what I was about to swag with. All right, we got about we got about twelve minutes left in this podcast. And and we've been talking about high school for the last two podcasts. Let's take a break because because next podcast is gonna be about our camping trip and other stuff. So we're gonna we're gonna take a break from high school stories. So let's let's go into the hotel, hotels with a with an S plural. Okay, let, all right. Let, let me let me yeah, start let, off. Let, let, right? Yeah, let, yeah. Okay, so basically for uh from ages, all right, from the dawn of time. No. so my parents, sorry, my mom, all right. She, when I have my birthdays, instead of having at my house and getting my house, you know, completely wrecked or, you know, whatever, so we could do whatever we want, you know, go in the I'm pool, whatever. I'm pretty sure if it happened whatever, at your house, Calvin would run through a wall. I mean, we, there was one time, and there was a fight at my house. <laughs> yeah, you're, and yeah. also, and I think that one time, last, Alvin freaking beat you with a gosh dang clown hammer in, in the middle of my hallway as it lit up. But um, so uh, for my happen. birthday, usually we go to a hotel. All right, we get all my friends. You know, we get like you know a couple beds. You know, and we just vibe in there. We hook up like I don't know whatever game console if it ever works because you know for some reason hotels never let you hook your HDMI's. 
But um, let's just say, uh, well, we want to do the one where we had all of us, right? Um, wait, we're, did I, I ever think, invite Sean? I think no, no, Sean was not around because these were before yeah. Sean's time. But Sean has definitely heard these <laughs> stories multiple times. I say we go with yeah, the most like... eventful one, which would be the last one. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right, fist spot, Donovan. Yeah. Let's, well, let's get, get with... jumped there. All right. Let's start with okay. the, the beginning so... of the day. All right. Or, or the beginning of all when right. everyone showed up. All right. All right. Let, let, let no. Let me. So okay. I. For so, okay, I don't know how you guys got there. Right? I just remember I we picked. I, I was like, "Yo, Marquis, you want to come with us?" And he was like, "Uh, sure." Like I just told him randomly that I met. Like he was at the park for some reason. My mom just picked him up. I never met his parents. His parents never met mine. But I just like robbed Marquis. All right, and he's never been with us before, so it was just different from all right. You know, we go to the hotel. Um, you came. Did Robbie come as well? You, yes, Robbie, Alvin. Yes. I think Calvin. Okay, my mom dropped me off. Alvin drove. Was it Your you? And, was, there. was it Calvin? Yeah, my cousin as well. Alvin was there, wasn't he? Yeah, yeah, he was. He came later. Yeah. Alvin came, and I think he took you, Calvin, and Robbie. Right? He dropped you guys off. Yeah. No. Uh. Or yeah. He was, he was there then, for the night, but yeah. he, he drove you guys. I my mom came yeah. and got me. I think, or or she dropped me off. I can't remember. Yeah. Anyways. So uh, I remember I had all my family, uh, my uncle who likes to drink, was out of it. <laughs> and um, so it started off wild. Was I remember it everyone day you looked... threw a chair in the pool? That was a yes, it time. was. No, that was a... Well, yeah, no. no, it was the time. It was the same day. You could tell how drunk And I antagonized was. it, just just let you people yep. know. <laughs> so uh, basically, I remember everyone was getting wild in there, and I was like, I'm not going. And I was just talking to family. Then I remember you guys pulled Alan in, and all I hear was beating sounds. And I remember the next day, he was like, Oh my back hurts. I think when you guys jumped on me or something. We all jumped him. <laughs> yeah, so it was very wild. Um Yeah, uh, I could keep on going, but Kevin, you wanna start taking over some of the stuff that happened? Well, I just remember because we all got there and we were all pretty chill and um yeah. mm -hmm. we, we yeah. go we we go to the pool. That's that's cause that's what started first, because then when we got out, that's when we hung out in the room for the, the rest of the night. Um, Wait. Okay, that that wasn't the day you hopped over the freaking table, and and, and the room. That, that that was a different day. That was a different day. Oh, th uh, room three ten. Yeah, but um, that was a different day. so <laughs> we go to um the pool, and it was like an indoor pool. So everyone's swimming, and I get out, and I'm talking to Alan, and I was like, "You don't be funny right now." And he's like, "What? What?" <laughs> and I'm like, "If you do that chair in the pool," he's like, "Nah." He's like, "Nah, I'm not gonna do that." And I remember I was like pussy and he gets up and he grabs the chair and he just hooks it in there he just no no he, he was like you said you said last time you're like yeah would it be more mad if i threw this, this chair in a pool <laughs> yes yes and i tyler said he all all he remembers hearing underwater was a loud crash <laughs> Dude, i <laughs> thought my someone was drowning from my perspective i was like under the water and i just i just see this huge shadow <laughs> just appear <laughs> above me and i just i just it just inside, I was like, Whoa. I was like, dude, someone just fell in the pool. And I get up and I see a lawn chair. Dude, no, I just turn around psh, and people yell. I'm like, What happened? Did someone go under? And it's freaking Alan's like girlfriend at the time yelling. It's like, What are you doing? It's like, You had yeah. enough, you need to go upstairs. <laughs> grabbed him by the arm like a child and like dragged him upstairs. That was the funniest part. So, pool's done. We get back to the room, um, and then we're all chilling. The, like the, the the bedroom because there was like two different rooms. That was a pretty cool room, um, and we were all like pillow fighting. And I remember, I remember what happened, man. I think I accidentally like backhanded you or something. No, no, this is what happened. All right, so okay, I wasn't oh. feeling good, and I, <laughs> I I later got sick. All right, but um, so I remember everyone was like pillow fighting. I remember like. Uh, Marquise was okay. Marquise was a bystander. He was trying to do his homework <laughs> in the corner because he's like, I gotta do a lot of homework. Y'all can do whatever you want, right? So I remember everyone was like hitting each other stuff. Then my cousin hit me like, like out of pocket. I was just like chilling. He hit me and the pillow swung and like it hit my head, but it flipped and hit me in the face. All right. And roll one, you don't hit a man in his eyes or or his face. All right. 
So I got mad, all right? I was already in a mad mood, and I freaking, like, nearly strangled my cousin, like, freaking... Christian? By... Remember that? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and then I was already mad, all right? And then I remember, um, I think Calvin started hitting me as well. And then we were just like, going at it, like, just constantly. It was just, like, pillow, pillow, pillow. Then I think no, no, either no. someone dropped I, their pillow or something. I got to tell my perspective. <laughs> all so, right. So me and my, my home dog, Robbie... We're, we're chilling on the side of a bed, like, sitting, like, with our back against a wall, just talking, and we had our feet up, like, on the bed, so we were, like, I don't know, in this, like, U-shaped position, like, our ass is on the ground, back against the wall, feet on a bed, all right? And we're just talking, and it went from, like, this pillow-hitting noise to just straight, just straight meat-on-meat meat action, and me and Rafi look at each other, and we're like, should we? And we just both got up, and we had to pull them, pry them apart, because I'm yeah. pretty sure one of them is about to kill the other. <laughs> yeah. And, it just, and we didn't, like, hate each other. It was just in the heat of the moment, all right? Yeah. Like, I, yeah. I, I, didn't, I didn't think, like, like I wasn't, like, <laughs> oh. mad at you after. I was, It was just I, rage. I wasn't mad at you either. I thought we were just duking it out, dude. Two bros <laughs> going and punching each other. I was I was having fun. The, the TV was also <laughs> playing um, Fully Cooly because they were about no, to premiere the new season. That was late. No, that was right. Yeah, that I was, was right before. No, I was watching a baseball game. The or, oh yeah, the yeah, I guess it was right after because I remember Dom me like I cannot see, and I was like, "Bro, look, anime." Yeah, and I was like, "What is this?" You just tell me all the lore. I was like, "Ah, uh, yeah." But I just remember, um, yeah, we went to pool that time, whatever. But I remember after, I felt so sick. All right, and usually with me, I only get sick in December. Like I always get sick the day of New Year's. Same. Yeah. And that 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 May broke the curse. Like I never get sick during May, so I got sick and I was just like out of commission. All right, I was just slumped. All right, I, it was really bad. And uh, you guys can go from there because I was kind of out of commission for a while. <laughs> okay. Problem number then one. the best night of the park comes. Problem... No, the best <laughs> night of the park comes. Okay. Problem number one is that one all the beds were taken up because we had marquise alvin christian didn't stay there and then we had donovan and the, the all the, the two beds in the spare room were taken up and the other only bed was the couch pull out that formed into a bed now before any of this calvin really wanted the ac to work because it was hot in there <laughs> And to get the AC to work, he used his head um, and yeah. slammed it against the case and completely so broke I, the whole case off. I crawled under the bed and I was, I, was messing with, I was actually trying to do it normally at first. And I was like, why won't this thing turn on? And that's before I knew ACs have like a timer. So I was like, all right. I cocked my head sideways and slammed it into the casing. <laughs> it cracked. Broke off both like the hatches <laughs> that lock onto it snapped, so I rip it off and I bang on the thing and it goes and it starts. I'm like, all right, cool. Uh -huh. I, I put the thing back on it, but it didn't go on correctly, so I kind of just laid it against there. I crawl back up. I was like, all right, guys, we want to watch some TV. The remote would not work. Hold the on. channels wouldn't work. <laughs> oh no, the God, channels okay. wouldn't work. Yeah. The volume wouldn't work. The power button wouldn't work. The input wouldn't work. Nothing. So I was like, okay. I took the batteries out, put them back in. I was and. No, because I remember the, the remote not being dead because the light would come on, like, completely. I was like, what is wrong with the thing? So with oh, the you... might of Zeus, I cock my hand towards the sky, <laughs> and I throw the remote at the floor as hard as I possibly can. It shatters. The remote works. I'm like, all right, cool. Uh, <laughs> no, no, no. It did not. It shattered and did not work because I had to crawl over to the other side of the room and reassemble the remote <laughs> back together and then hand it back to you and be like, I guess it works, Don. I don't know what the fuck you did. I think Robbie was just sitting in the corner eating mac and cheese pizza rolls. And he could not stop laughing. Like, he, Dude, I he was, was kill dying him laughing. Laughter. I was dying laughing, too. Dude, I so, like Robbie's laugh. No, and then... So, I was like, I'm kind of thirsty. So, me, Robbie, <laughs> and Tyler like get creep. up. We, we get up, and we go to the lobby, and we make some coffee. Dude, I love coffee. Coffee's the best thing in the world, bro. Okay, so, this, oh, yeah. You weren't, I mean, you weren't coffee. supposed to leave, weren't you guys? Yeah, we weren't. His, you guys stayed up. Mom specifically said yeah. you are not oh allowed my. to leave this room. Bro, and the next thing we did and slammed me on the couch, and she's like, "Make the bed." <laughs> I wanted to sleep on the floor. I was like, "Oh, this floor is so nice." She picks me up, she slams me down, and she's like, "Make the bed." I'm like, "I don't wanna," and she leaves the room. So I was like, "Oh," <laughs> so we make the bed. No, no, she, she was like, she leaves the room and oh. and tells us not to leave. 
And the second oh, we, yeah. like, see her disappear, we booked it out the fucking door and ran past the room they were staying in. Yeah, and then we got coffee. And this was probably, what, 2 a.m.? <laughs> yeah. And we're running we around the hotel. We, we run out to, like, the <laughs> lobby with, like, no shoes on or anything. We're just, like, completely, like, half fucking dressed and, like, destroyed. We get, like, six coffees for, like, the three of us. I had three. Just to let you know, I had three of those. Three of those were mine. I and one. I drank one, I drank half of one, and then I remember finishing it. We were, we, I think I, we were pretty calm for a little bit, Tyler. And then that's when I realized my third cup of coffee was cold, and I don't know why, but it just enraged me. <laughs> I was so angry. So what do I do? I take the cup and I throw it into the wall. I threw it. I just started <laughs> swinging coffee everywhere. Coffee stains on the wall, in the lampshade, everywhere. As soon as the coffee hits. His mom walked back in. No, no, no. And the coffee oh, wait, hit the no. wall, and I panicked. I was like, this is the worst thing that could have happened. I started taking, like, the little napkins they give you, because we grabbed, like, a oh, couple yeah. of the coffee crap. I started scrubbing the walls, and it was all over the lampshade and the refrigerator and the cabinets and the fucking ceiling. And I was just sort of, I was like, all right, little bit little. I was just, like, scrubbing the walls, and I hear the door open. His mom's like, what the frick did you guys do? She was like, because originally she was like, Tyler, what are you doing? And I was like, um, <laughs> germs. <laughs> I don't remember exactly what I said, but I just remember trying to hide the lampshade as much as I possibly could because that was irreversible damage. <laughs> and then I remember some point someone faked up the sheets and did, there was a hole in the sheet. Like there was like it ripped. <laughs> From the inside. So, you know, like, usually blankets have, uh, like, two layers. Like, they just put, like, two and they kind of, like, put it together. It's Somehow, true. someone ripped a hole through it. <laughs> so, it was... You can wear it, like, as a freaking, like, pillow sheet, basically. Like a snuggie. Oh, my God. Dude, that night was... <sighs> top top three nights of my life. Probably. That was so much yeah. fun. That was, good, that was good I can times. Only, I can only imagine what would have happened if Donovan was awake for that. <laughs> Oh, dude, dude, I, I was just you, I so. I know, we so best bad. be doing that for your 18. If we ain't doing it for uh, your 18th, and I, if I have a job by then, I'll buy the room. All right. And I, my mom was like, "Yo, we're never doing this again." She was like, <laughs> <laughs> it was so bad. And then COVID happened, and then freaking half of the hotels were used for like homeless people or something. I don't remember. Yeah. yeah. So then we're like, "That's dangerous." Um, yeah. Before we. Well, do we have any time left? Uh, I mean, we can at, keep on going. I mean, we just... Yeah. Our minimum time is an hour, all right? Yeah, we're we, in, we can we're make it a long hour. episode. Well, hour then, hour I'll right ask now. him. Sean, huh. what's... Because I know, I know you haven't talked much, but I was just going to ask, what um, what's a memory you, like, remember with me that's just funny that, you, that you're not going to forget? Half of the things are, like, illegal, so... That's not... No, everything no, we just no. described in the last story was illegal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sick. Now you can't put me on the spot like that. I have to remember now. Dude, well then take I, your time and think. I'm not gonna lie, I that forgot you were time. here. Yeah, no, it's messed I, up. I, no, I've, been, I've, I've been wanting to talk to Sean, but it's just like most of the beginning memories are without him, and then yeah. like everything recent's been well, with him. Well, we can. We'll do, okay, so we briefly talked about the Ventura story last time. Do you, no, do I don't have, want to talk about it. Do you have it. anything to add? Because I think I went over yeah, most of it. Well, no, because you you said when you when you almost broke the car on the freeway, I I remember, I I, I, I didn't look like yeah, I didn't I know what, back at you and you're like because I look what's up going on, dude. I look up and I looked at you like we were gonna die. I was like, what are you doing? Because all I heard was the car go. What? I was like, what the heck happened? I was like, oh my god, because car his car doesn't do that. So I was like. Dude, I'm scared. And Tyler, Tyler, he looked, oh, oh, I know what I want to add on. When we got to your house, you crashed. Me and Sean played with your kittens for like four hours. (laughs) Oh, yeah. Like 5 a.m. So, and we watched the kitties no, in, the in your mom's bathroom. Yeah, there was a fight club. Yeah, a fight a fight club. club. The, the, the cats, like multiple cats, would sit on the outside of the shower, and then two would go in and start slap boxing each other. And yeah. then like, the the loser would leave, and then another one would go in there and start slap boxing. Dude, it was crazy. Dude, we like, I, okay, hold on. Fuck? I swear to God, I do not run an underground cat boxing facility out of my house. 
I do not do that. Uh, I could. I. I would never. All right. I don't yeah, know what happened. Yeah, they were throwing a catnip. They were fucking betting. I drove crazy. for like four hours and I was up at like six a.m. to get everyone ready to go for to Ventura. So I was very tired. So I went to sleep. I have no idea what happened after that. Because I, I was playing the freaking the Civil War Roblox. Or oh, some yeah. Shit oh yeah. Oh yeah. No. <laughs> oh yeah. And then that oh, same yeah. night. So my family yeah. was gone. And that same night, we used every oh, single yeah, yeah. bed in the entire house. No, I was on the couch. Oh, I, was, I, I, was I woke up from my bed. I look around. I'm like, where are they? I see Sean on the couch. I see Calvin chilling in my mom's bed. Just straight <laughs> sprawled out, laying down. I'm like, man, homie's really yeah, balling. So what happened was, is I was cutting, cuddling with the little tiny black and white cat. I was like, you're my homie, guy. I was like petting him. Mm-hmm. And I was on Instagram. And I closed my eyes and I opened it. And it's like 10 a.m. And I was like, what happened? When I talked yeah, about remember, how we were so, waking up so and I was like a- turned... Oh yeah, yeah we yeah. all woke up I was separately. A, I was waiting awake. for one another. I was awake. Calvin woke up. He came into my room. He's like, "What you doing?" Passed out immediately on my bed, and I was like, "Man, I'm kind of tired still." Freaking went into my brother's room, slept on his bed. Then apparently Sean woke up. Yeah, and, but I was like, "Are they gonna come out here?" I'll just I'll wake up. Or like I'll just chill here till they come out. Then I fell asleep, and then you guys come out in the living room while I'm knocked out. Yeah. God, we could not figure out a schedule. But that night, that yeah. night was well. I don't remember much from the night, but that day was fun. It really was. I was getting harassed by like two of your cats. They wouldn't leave me alone. Dude, that one little like pure black one kept clawing me and Sean. Yeah. Like he was, he was on a mission, bro. He, was a little he did not like us there. <laughs> oh yeah, and then me and Sean spent hours trying to calculate the math of when to like. like... Like what cat is what part of what generation and what's the parents and yeah. which one's like do we we were trying to figure out your entire cat breeds but we could not like well because there was like small ones tiny ones medium ones and big ones all right i'm like all right that's the first generation i'm like okay those two must be the parents and those are the second generation so i'm like thinking I'm like okay then that one got with that one and made those three are those are the third generation well you you but there's like no some now. Other random cats would come out you know, some other random cats come out, and we'd be like, what cat is that? You... Like, we didn't see him all night, and he'd just come out. It was like a grayish one that was kind of medium-sized. We locked Frank in the like... closet. Oh, oh my yeah, god. We... Oh, yeah. You locked yeah. my sausage dog in the closet? No, no, because he walked in there. Annoying. He was <coughs> No, no, no. He walked in there. We didn't know he was in there. We were getting a cat out, and the cat finally left, and then we closed the door. And we didn't know he was in there. <laughs> so... I mean, I didn't know he was in there. Maybe Calvin didn't, didn't tell me. But... I was gonna say something. <laughs> I can't remember. All right, but we're at, we're over a minute ten now, so it's time we start wrapping things up. An hour ten or a minute ten? Hour ten. Did he... Hour bad time. Ten. Yeah, that's one long like... minute. <laughs> I was like, dang. Yeah, about that's five minutes in the podcast in the right now. Um. All right, so next week we got uh, Calvin's gonna be back. Um, we're also going to have Calvin's boyfriend, Montana. And... My girlfriend. Uh, that's not going to be a thing. That's not where I'm going to say this. <laughs> okay, okay. And then we're also going to have Dallas. I guess, I guess I'll talk about how I met her in the next episode. Yeah, yeah. We'll talk about the intro and stuff. Because Dallas is my Dallas. first friend ever. So, so. so then we're going to talk about um, the camping trip we went on. And some New Year's stuff that just happened. That was pretty fun. Oh, yeah. Um, how are we going to talk about half that night? I don't know about half about... Uh... Well, well, it's already teased. <laughs> wait, we can bring up we can bring up Pennsylvania. That's yeah, the only we thing can, we need to bring Pennsylvania. up. Pennsylvania. You guys will know what that means. All right. Well, thanks for tuning in. Uh, we'll see you guys right. next week, I guess. Yeah. Next week, by on the same time when this is posted. I love you all. No. I know yeah. your favorite already. Just tell me in yeah. the comments. Yeah. No, we we don't need to have beef or be like, oh yeah, you're my favorite. <laughs> Dude, I'll fight somebody. Well, like, think about it. if we get like a bunch of fans, they're gonna like yeah. you know they're gonna yeah. be like it's kind of like what what like when I ask you, Don, I mean, like who's your favorite impractical Joker? Like when you have yeah. like groups like that, people like so I, I just know I'm gonna be the favorite. Yeah, <laughs> no, the, 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 you're gonna be the one that you that's gonna freaking disappear for a while. Like where do you go? Like, oh, you in federal prison? You know, all the, all the delinquents <laughs> are gonna all the delinquents are gonna be like, can I be your friend, bro? Like. Like teach me how to yeah. get away with this. I'm like, I can't, I can't endorse that. I'm, I'm, I'm waiting to see all those one v one Rocket League uh, recommendations. Yeah, I'm, I'm down too. We'll, Anybody, we'll, we'll, Sergeant we'll, Enable we'll, on we'll Steam. We'll set up post a set up a four v four. Set up a four v four. I'm down. Yeah, yeah. Our podcast versus yeah. your guys's. Yeah, our <laughs> podcast. Yeah, winning podcast takes 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 the other subscribers.
If you guys win against us, we'll shout. Oh, uh, actually, no. Uh, I do not <laughs> <laughs> all right, we better be in your eight game. We'll, we'll see you all. I, I cannot wait to talk about how I fell in the lake right at the very end of our mission. Oh, my, oh my all right, shout out to me. All right, thanks for all tuning right, in. Like a, we'll see like you all a, next week. All right, bye. Bye. All right, y'all.